So I'm like, okay, cool. You're gonna refund the whole order, but what the f am I gonna wear? Hey babes, welcome back to my YouTube channel. If it is your first time joining us, thank you so much for stopping by. I really do hope that you stay, you subscribe, and you become a part of the CX family. <laughs> As you guys can see by the title today, I'm going home, I'm going home You better tell the world that I'm going home Guys, I'm so excited to be going back to Cape Town today Yes, sus. I miss my city, not really <laughs> I miss my family, I miss my friends I'm so excited to see everyone And I miss my house, my mother's house Guys, I need to be in my mother's house I need to be at peace, you know what I'm saying? I need a break from this bitch, this, this Joburg life and get bona, you know, my calm, you know, my peace. You know what I'm saying? So I'm super excited to go home. Ah! And um, my flight is leaving at 23 minutes past 3. Right now, uh, it is probably around 11, 10, 30 at the earliest. And I'm about, I'm just like cleaning up my stuff, packing up. I already took a shower, I already got ready so that I can just pick up my stuff and vibe. So yeah guys, I'm being very organized, you guys can see my ZX is trying to work on her latism because my mother is definitely going to kill me if I'm late to this flight or if I miss it. She also told me like, that flight said 325 but she's like, you better be there, you better be leaving at 12. I'm like, 12, girl? She says I should leave at 12 but I'm like, you're being dramatic. I'm probably going to leave here at 1. Probably gonna leave you at one, um, just so that I am on time for the flights because I don't know how traffic's gonna be, be and stuff like that. So yeah, I'm I'm trying to take as little as possible to Joburg because of uh, to Cape Town, sorry, because of the fact that I have so many winter jackets that I need to bring when I come back, so I can't have too much stuff. But also, it's so difficult because like. I want to film some content for you guys when I'm in Cape Town because my friends are gonna be there for girl talks. Um, obviously just regular vlog content i wanted to actually film on the day of my graduation not just a vlog but like me getting ready and stuff but uh my lighting it's not gonna happen like i realized that traveling by yourself with lighting and everything it's not gonna work because then i'll have to carry the bag the light stand my carry-on luggage and my big bag that's four separate items i'm only one person and my other like backpack so that's really five and i'm like i'm only one person i'm not gonna be able to carry all of this stuff by myself so i'm just bringing my tripod and then i'm gonna have to find some really really good natural lighting if the content is not at my usual standard please know please know that i do apologize because i had to leave a big part of like what makes my content really really great which is ring lights but anyways without saying too much else um yeah i'm just gonna pack and then probably i'll probably meet up with you guys when i'm on my way to the airport or when i'm at the airport so see you soon guys i'm so happy to be home you guys have no idea like i'm 
crying. Like I literally, when I saw Table Mountain as we were coming down, I was like, oh my word. And the sea. I was like, home sweet motherfucker home. Like we're at home now. So, okay, I need to tell you guys something. That was a pretty hectic that happened. In this package lies plan B of my graduation outfit. So basically what happened was that I um, ordered an outfit from Pretty Little Things. I'm pretty much just gonna tell you now because I don't even think it's coming. It's not coming, actually, let's just be honest. So I ordered it to come to my place in Joburg because I ordered it like, I wanna say uh, maybe the 12th of April and I was hoping that it would be here before I left. I left, that was, I left Pretty, today's the 11th so it's like a month after so i ordered it and it said it should be here by the 29th of march so i was like beautiful it's gonna be here early i'm gonna be good so i order it um to come then and yeah since the 30th it's been in Joburg for like i want to say two to three weeks but from the 30th of march so it arrived the week before the 30th of march right and then it was in customs for a week so i'm thinking okay i was like excited because when it got there the week before i was like okay it's even gonna be here like the week before it said it was gonna be here it's already in Joburg, so it might stay in customs for like a week and then i'll be good no doll so that week passes obviously i leave it because i'm like okay it's gonna be in customs then that saturday which was now the 30th of march that is the last time it updates its tracking information the next week passes i'm like okay what's going on i keep checking keep checking i'm trying to call customs and no one answers i probably called them like 10 times no one answered different times of the day and all throughout that week the next week comes i think that's this week if i'm not mistaken if i'm not getting these dates mixed up but then now i'm i email a pretty little thing and i'm like guys where's my my thing like i don't understand and they're like they're so sorry um about everything shame they were really really good with their customer service they were like they're so sorry about everything like they refunded me for my shipping because they were like shipping i mean it didn't get to you on time so they refunded me my shipping so they're like if it still doesn't come by the 15th of april they're gonna refund the whole order so i'm like okay cool you're gonna refund the whole order but what the fuck am i gonna wear so that was my stress i've been stressing about it but i just decided like okay zx you need not stress about this because the more you stress about it it's not gonna you're not gonna get an outfit by stressing like that's not a thing you don't stress and then get an outfit <laughs> or like cry and dwell and do all of this theatrics like you can do that for maybe like a few hours but then you need to look for an outfit so i had a specific vision in mind for my graduation like i had a color scheme and everything you know sort of so i was like i don't want to change that i still want to do what i want to do i'm so sorry it's out of focus yeah, so as I was saying, I didn't want to change my color scheme or change what I was pretty much going for um, in the in the whole graduation thing. So um, I just decided to find another dress that I really liked that was still going to give me the same vision and the same sort of goal. So I haven't seen the dress yet. I'm really, really nervous to check it out because if I don't like it, <laughs> it's so over. Like it's over for me. I don't know what I'm going to do. But yeah, so I'm going to check out the dress. I'm going to try it on not right now. Because I want to just see how it looks and then I'll try it on a bit later. If it's not fitting me like how I want it to fit. Now, tomorrow I'm going to try go to the tailor. We have one that's really close to here. And ask them what they can do for me. If not, I'm going to ask Wendy to help me um, with it. Um, I haven't decided what shoe I'm going to wear yet. <laughs> But um, I'm going to have a look on Super Bullets and I've, I've been looking but I haven't found something that's like screaming to me and the one that I found that was screaming to me was literally like really expensive so I was just like I've spent so much money on this graduation so far and all I really have is a dress one dress in the original pile or pile order rather I ordered a dress I ordered accessories and stuff now I only have a dress and I've spent so much money so I need to just where I can cut down I need to cut down but anyways just want to let you guys know I'm at home I got my dress hopefully hope everything's gonna go really well and I'm about to eat watch TV chill live my best life <laughs> Hey guys, it's the morning, the next morning. I'm at MTN with my mummy to come and look for new fans. I'll see you guys inside.
Okay, what's up guys? I'm hiding cotton on because I don't want to get kicked out and I know how these people are. But um, after we went to go and look for the phones or to upgrade our phones, basically both of us were upgrading. Um, the system was offline or whatever, so they weren't able to process our phones. But I'm getting an XS. So excited. Um, they weren't able to process it, so my mom's gonna go pick up our phones either after work today or tomorrow morning. So you guys will get to see it tomorrow. So we just came here to Cavendish because I wanted to find um, earrings for my dress. And I got them from Lodisa. I'll show you guys. No, I won't show you guys when I get home. I want you guys to see the whole outfit together. So right now, just looking around at Cotton On for just anything really. And then after this, I'm gonna go to Asanda's place to chill with her and Luvi and just catch up basically. <laughs> Even have a Vaseline face. <laughs> No, Guys, I'm with Luvi. Um, it show me I'm so cute. She stays diminishing me this one. It's actually ridiculous. I'm not even lying though. She well, is cute. literally diminishing me. Luvie, in front of your fans. In front of your oh, fans. So she really does look cute, guys. She looks like an innocent yeah, child, the innocent wait, wait. child that she is. Uh, because because I am. Exactly. Debatable. I just want them to see that actually the, the diamant is. <laughs> what year are we in? We're going to try again. Birthday! We're going to try again. Keep it there, guys. Keep it there! Keep it there! Come back! Right, right? Yeah, she done must be. Yeah, she's done. Yeah, yeah. Nakiveh. So my problem, guys, that she's still sober and she's acting like this. <laughs> guys, I'm just so excited to see Zama because you people stole her from us. Is it them? Some of them are definitely in Cape Town. Y'all niggas stole her from me. She's on board. You'll find me. You'll catch me. I don't know why she's threatening. Easy subscribers, Zam. I'm so stressed. I I'm not threatening. Hey guys, it is the next day, um, the day after Zippy's birthday send in, not even send off, send in. So basically what we did is that we just chilled, we hung out, we played like these freaking hilarious games. And then um, we just prayed her into her birthday and it was really, really nice. Chilled vibes, amazing and lovely to catch up with everyone. I'm off to go and be Isoka mom, rugby mom, and I'm gonna go watch my brother <laughs> at his rugby match. <laughs> Um, I don't know if I can do this. I'm gonna do it for him. Okay, hi guys. I don't think I um, updated you guys enough in the day, but after I watched my brother's rugby, by the way, his team didn't win, but good efforts on his part. Shame he was really out there tackling, tackling, tackling. But I'm back home now. I think I'm gonna take a bit of a nap. Oh, yes, by the way, I got my new phone. Let me show it to you guys. Basically, I got the new iPhone XS and then I just got a cover. <laughs> but I'm so annoyed because look at this. We had to leave it yesterday, as you guys know. So, the I don't know if you guys can see, but there are bubbles on my frippin' screen cover. That's so irritating. So, I'm and I think we're going to take them back. Um, but look how stunning. I'm so happy. I need to charge it now for like two to three hours but how gorge how gorge how gorge 
definitely give my video a thumbs up if you guys would like to see a iphone tour so me basically just taking you guys to my new iphone um because i already did a what's on my iphone i would love to do an updated one because i did get a new phone just so that you guys can see like the differences maybe i don't know because i'm still gonna i might keep my old phone or i might give it to my little brother because he says he wants a new phone and then take his phone and use it as my data sim because my new phone has 256 i think gigabytes on it which is like literally double the one that i had before and i honestly didn't even honestly use all the space so this phone has a lot of space so i think um I'm just gonna let him have my old phone and then I'll take his phone because the reason I need two phones because I want one to be like my modem for my data sim but besides the point let me know if you guys want to see want to see an updated um what's my iPhone tour or video definitely like this video so I know if you guys want that what's up guys we're back with car chronicles I'm so sorry I literally said I was gonna update you guys yesterday I fully lied I fell asleep yesterday guys i knocked out for like five hours no joke so um there's nothing that happened yesterday i am a granny at heart i was so tired i feel like i've been waking up early a lot a lot's been happening so i needed i think i needed yesterday as a rest day but here we go but today i am now going to the shops quickly to buy some bleach i'm gonna be bleaching deborah's hair for her for her graduation and then afterwards i'm gonna go get my nails done and then there is potential for me to go out tonight but we'll see how it goes because tomorrow i'm have quite an early morning again because i need to go to campus to pick up my gown for graduation i think today's where the vlog's gonna end the first vlog then i'm gonna do a separate one for graduation of course and then there'll be just end of cape town vlog so it's going to be three vlogs because you guys did win the poll the three mini vlogs did win the poll my communities tab if you guys want to participate in any more polls and stuff like that definitely check out my communities eh, communities tab more frequently because i'm going to start interacting with you guys on there way more volume down a bit yeah. or even off because it's gonna copyright me it took me my liam okay guys i'm done with my nails grad nails say what's up do you see gold i don't know if this is giving you hints as to what the outfit's gonna be but in short in zobai like el a gold like el or do the most but um i'm here at refilo's place um we are we just shot a video you guys will see it soon because i know for a fact this vlog is going to go up first <laughs> so you guys will see the video soon hopefully the footage looks good if it doesn't look good it's just going to be very awkward actually in fact if it doesn't look good we're going to film it again when say, we both get to work with each other <laughs> so yeah but hopefully we don't have to do that because that's just a waste of everyone's time um we're just having a chilled situation for now we had plans to go out but our friends Haiki was still going out. Okay, Haiki was still gonna go out, but like we had big plans to go out. And then our friend said, just 10, just Tima that volume, Tima volume for those plans. So, anyways, but we out here. Application for new friends. Yeah, guys, if you guys wanna be our friend, just apply, send me an email. No, I'm joking. And in fact, stop sending me weird emails, guys. Email you my I just had to put that out there because guys, uh, uh, emails are not to play with. Yo, no. Alrighty guys, Rufilo and I are going to be force masters. We just got ready to go home. And if you guys don't know where home is at this stage of watching my vlogs, it's problematic. It's a problem. Comment down below if you know what home is. You should know. <laughs> what home is so i'm gonna close the vlog off here i'm going to start a new vlog tomorrow for um preps day before uh day before grad preps philo wants to say hi to you guys hi guys or bye rather we're going home <laughs> we're going it's time Rinka is here she doesn't know what i mean it's time to go here. home i do know what that means from game of thrones relax anyways we're going to our home and i'll see you guys tomorrow i'm gonna insert snaps after this of what happens if it was snap worthy if it wasn't snap worthy just know that's why i didn't put snaps and i'll see you guys in the next vlog stay tuned and i'll see you guys bye